Hello guys, welcome back to Civil Engineers YouTube channel. Today in this short video lecture, I will guide you for quantity of cement in M25 grade of concrete. If you want to build any kind of building, if that is commercial building or residential building and you need to find out the quantity of cement uh, in M25 grade of concrete. So watch this video till the end to know about the estimation of cement in building construction. So let's get started guys. Remember, before starting the video, I will tell you, we are finding the quantity of cement in M25 grade of concrete. So therefore, the ratio for M25 grade concrete is one ratio, one ratio, two, where one part is cement, one part is sand, and two parts are crushed, or you can say aggregate. So some of the ratio, especially for M25 grade of concrete, so one plus one plus two is equal four. So this is sum of ratio. Now, in this sum of ratio, we will find the quantity of cement in M25 grade of concrete. So, we required quantity of cement. So, therefore, if you are finding the volume of concrete, if that is beam, column, slab, foundation, or any structure, RCC, so that is wet volume. So, the wet volume should be converted to the dry volume. volume. That's why, because from the uh, market, we are bringing the dry material. Uh, in the form of cement or sand or crush you can say so therefore it should be converted to the dry volume so therefore wet volume increased 54 percent to get dry volume so therefore note wet volume increased 54 percent to get dry volume and material or if that is cement sand or aggregate so therefore the dry volume is 1.54 that's why because i'm finding the uh, quantity of cement in one cubic meter one cubic meter so therefore one cubic meter should be divided by uh, with 1.54 so therefore that's why because it it, it increased uh, 54 percent so therefore we have the total volume 1.54 if you uh, if you see here quantity of cement so one divided by so this is dry volume remember here so if you have one cubic meter or two cubic meter Two meter cube you can say the weight volume okay so you will multiply with 1.54 to get dry volume so then you will get the dry volume so this is very important so if you not uh, if you don't find the dry volume and you are finding the quantity of different materials so that will be wrong okay Th that is not the proper way so there will be uh, so you will lose a lot of material inside the building construction so therefore the weight volume should be converted to the dry volume so therefore quantity of cement one one is part of cement here you can see sum of ratio you can see that is four so one ratio one ratio two so we are finding the cement so one part is cement so one divided by sum of ratio which is four as you can see here so therefore multiply 1.54 in one cubic meter so therefore we have 0 0.385 cubic meter the dry volume of uh, not the dry volume you can say this is the uh, volume of cement that's why because sum of ratio you can see this is four and uh, we have one number cement in this ratio which is m25 grade concrete multiply dry volume where dry volume is 1.54 because the weight volume it was uh, one uh, meter cube so therefore uh, it increased 54 percent so we have 1.54 so this is the volume of cement so now let me convert to the cement bags then you will know uh, very well that how many cement bags are required to construct m20 grade concrete for one cubic meter so in one cubic meter you have this volume 1.54 so therefore now convert it to the cement bag so therefore this is the dry volume of cement are not dry volume so this is the volume of cement so divide by 0 0.035 that's why because one bag of cement volume is 0 0.035 cubic meter that's why because if you see one bag of cement is equal one bag is equal 1.2 25 CFT. So one bag cement is equal 0 0.035 meter cube. So therefore, this is the volume of cement. So it should be divided by 0 0.035 because this is the volume of one bag cement. So we required 11 bags of cement for one cubic meter. Uh, you can say for one cubic meter volume of concrete. If you have two cubic meter if you have five cubic meter etc then you can find the total numbers of cement bags now you can multiply with the price of cement then you will get the total amount for the cement 
to construct your house or any kind of residential building. Hope this short video can help you. Thanks for watching. See you in next video. Goodbye.